several hundred churches. No one knows quite how many. And several monasteries dot the rugged landscape of Santorini. Many of the churches are quite old and out of the way, built by locals in thanks perhaps for a good fish catch or a healthy crop. You can find them in the unlikeliest places, such as clinging to an impossible rock or nestling inside the odd vineyard. Every church, however large or small, is named after a saint in the Orthodox calendar and is thus very well taken care of. For example, many have a spotless coat of shimmering blue paint on the cupolas, playing with the deep blue of the sky and sea to form a panorama that has been reproduced endlessly in picture postcards and artists' canvases. The monastery of Profiti Silia stands on the side of the height of the same name, overlooking the sea to the southeast. It's a hive of activity, from winemaking to repairing shoes. The monks don't mind seeing visitors, and you could get a glass of homemade wine or liqueur. But they tend not to keep regular hours for the public, so it's wise to make sure Profiti Silias is open before making the climb. The town hall at Fira can advise you about visiting hours or give you a telephone number to call. More from mysantorini.tv soon.